We're giving out free produce. I've been teaming up with uh, Nurturing Roots Farms. It's a black-owned farm. We just want to give back to the community. For three decades, the corner store on 28th and Jackson has been a part of Sammy Abrera's family. So my parents uh, are immigrants from Eritrea, and they came here and worked for several years, multiple jobs, hard-working people, just saved up their whole life savings and uh, purchased the store. Sammy is the store's current owner. A lot of the community knows me. You know, they've known me since I was a kid. They come in here and say, hey, I remember you when they were this high. He's starting a GoFundMe to help raise money for needed upgrades to the shop as it struggles with fewer customers due to the coronavirus. We need some electrical work done. Uh, I have a kitchen back there that I want to uh, remodel and, uh, you know, get new equipment in there. Outside of his store, Sammy has another vision, becoming a community resource, offering free produce to anyone who needs it something Kayla Ferguson says is vital. Due to gentrification, uh, the red apple on 23rd and Jackson got destroyed. So people in this area are not allowed to get, or it makes it harder for people to get culturally appropriate foods. So with Sammy being here and giving out free produce, it's a, it's a way to get back to the community. You know, during these hard times, especially during COVID, people are losing their jobs, people are getting evicted. It's just nice to have a space for the black community to be here. Sammy says his family has resisted offers to sell, not wanting to contribute to more gentrification of the Central District. So we want to stay here. We don't want to be a, a part of that group. We, we want to stay here and we want to continue to stay here for our people. You know, we, we do not want to get kicked out of what we built for so long, what my parents built for so long. We don't want anyone to take that from us. Tony Black, King 5 News.